Why haven't we been let in on the COG in these bases in case of biological release, asteroids, nuclear war? Because we're seen as the enemy. America's been conquered by offshore banks. Do you, under, do you understand that? We're run. Our government has been hijacked by our enemies. There's no bunker for you and your family like Switzerland. They've spent a hundred times the money per capita. And it's all built so they can do whatever they want to us. And the whole thing is manned by military and others and corporate people. That's what they're getting rid of the military, bringing in corporates and bringing in drones and bringing in robots. And please don't send me an idiotic email about we're not run by drones and robots. They've already got half the stuff in the air is robot. And they've kept quiet the ground force because that does freak out people. They want to think of men fighting like John Wayne. Within 10 years, no more John Wayne. Okay? I mean, this. listen, there's not a lot of time to screw around, folks. Okay, how much of what I've said has come true so far? If we don't have an awakening now and put the brakes on this, I want America to be great and prosperous. But there's three three things, four, three or four things could happen. Total World War III, globalist win, launch bioattacks on us, lockdown society, end of humanity as we know it. Uh, the global tyranny overreaches, has some wars, fails and collapses. That's much better. Depression, starving in the streets better than them going ahead with the full plan. Or we could wake up, put the brakes on, have some sanity, and, and, and pull back from this.